Polensky was at tonight's game and joins us now live at the TD Garden with a recap. Ruthie. Well, Yanni, the 5-1 score doesn't really explain the story. For the first half of this game, it looked like it was going to be a nail-biter. Tied at one up until the second period, and then it was those two goals from David Backus and then David Posternock that proved to be the momentum turning point in this one. We caught up with the players and the, t and the coach just moments ago. We were ready, we were on time, and we were energized. That's what it looked like to me. We were winning pucks, getting it behind their D. That The way you want to play early on, force them to break out pucks. You know, we made the plays that we had to, to make, and uh, um, and I thought that was uh, that was great for us, a uh, com great conference builder. Trying to play, you know, I think that's kind of when we're at our best is when we just play and don't think too much and, and don't worry about too much of the outside noise. I think as a collective unit, we all just looked at each other and said it's time to go out there, do our thing, and not be distracted by anything. And um, it was a pretty solid effort. Again, they, they made a pretty good push into the first, first half of the second, and uh, we had to respond, and we did respond, which is a good sign. Yanni, the Bruins and the Maple Leafs back in action here at a what was a rowdy TD Garden tonight on Saturday at 8 o'clock. For now, reporting live at, in Boston, I'm Ruthie Polinsky, Eyewitness Sports.